a Farsa o side lane. Farsa side lane. Although nakita natin to maraming beses, uh, at least for me personally, nung napanood ko yung uh, Indonesian leagues, mm. or tsaka yung mga nasa Southeast Asia na mga liga natin, meron talaga silang mga designated, meron talaga silang parang acclimation or preference na meron kang mage side lane. Mm. So, nandun yung Lunox, nandun yung mga Chango, paborito nila, Farsa also fits. Minsan nga, may Valir pa. Uh-oh. So, ang idea is... Side lane? Side lane, Valir. Valir. Okay, yes, exactly. Wow. Kasi your idea is to snowball more ng mas mabilis, tapos meron ka pang clear ng wave no matter what happens in the late game. Mm. So, hindi natin sinasabing ito yung maganda na talagang solid na may playstyle. It's just that it's just that it's valid. So, meron na pong gumagawa ito. Now, uh, Farsa on Toshi means na ito ay lalaroin as core na nandun sa side is magstay. And honestly, it's very strong. Uh, mag- wala din kasing tank dito sa side ng... Uh, ng ng NXP apart from Gatot Katcha I mean, pero pero wala sila nung hard tank support uh, diba ng hard tank support yeah uh, hard tank support kung ha- support tank yung hinahanap Oo. natin pero yeah um we're accounting for side lanes din kasi mm-hmm. pero like game medyo mas makunat yung kakalabasan ng uh, NXP Absolutely. dito just because, just because of the Alice and the uh, Gatot Katcha i can't help but feel na talagang ang call dito ng Omega fight in the early Oo. game we have our heroes running forward ano right. na angas uh, angas no na yung takbo ng Hayabusa <laughs> tapos nung anime na anime <laughs> oh anime na anime yung entrada mga kaibigan una nating laban sa uling araw ng ikaapat na linggo ng MPL season 6 regular season uh-huh. NXP versus Omega very early Chester taking advantage doon sa Scimitar na meron niya itong si Khalid taking na uh, mga damage sa matalang Omega naman setting up for that early Selena take on the jungle kasi may Hayabusa hit gonna be playing on a support cho tank support niya sinasabi natin yeah and uh, all is good in the hood para sa side lane sa Omega para naman sa LXP solid hindi mo rin matatawaran yung jungle take speed nila just because the fact that it's uh, mm. it's Kali then it's Kala ko na nakakulit ulit Wanderer ah, pero nakuha naman ni Haze mm-hmm. no? MB na pwersa na uh, mag-react din dito sa gitna and it's a mm. first blood for Omega kasi yeah. nga naman tatloy na yung mem- ang dami ah no apat pala sorry apat yes. na members sa Omega nandun yawi Xberg support no? yeah. kaya nga no y- yun yun yung ano uh, medyo kahirapan kasi I mean, okay naman yung Xberg support. Totally understandable. The, the secret is because immortality kasi ang mura dyan. Oh. No? And that's a staple item para dito sa Xberg. Ang problema yung initiating power. Alam mo yun, torchback, torchback ka. Naku There's po. the arrow. Naku po, kakagat na lang si Ace dito. Actually, di lang maka-transform yata. There's on to Chester. Kakabuhay lang yan. Kakabuhay lang yan. Ano kayo itong ginawa ni Hajizi dito? Tinamaan na ng pana yung yung hero na kalaban niya, normally, na- I would say 90% of players pupunta para sa kill. Mm-hmm. Pero ang ginawa niya, nag-take ng purple buff. Kasi mas importante, ayun naman, nanakaw yun. Oh. And now he is a level, a level ahead of H2. What? Tapos nakaw pa siya ng kill. Bonus na lang yes. din dahil tumama yung pana. Yes, that's already a massive win para sa side ng Omega oh. dito. Sa totoo lang nga, may visible goal deficit na. Ito to yung sinasabi ko, napaka-underrated ni Hit. Grabing pressure yan ha. Oh. Kahit konting dance around lang. Even Chester was forced to react actually. Yes. Against it. And yeah. alata naman na ng B-Bait! No, Round 3! Ay, Jester! I mean, magnet! Namiss niya nga tayo yung si Lina, tol. Na magnet. Kaso si Lina ng kabila, Man, ayun eh. Man. Ito yung problema, pare ko. Eh, kasi nag-first pick sila ng, ng Khalid. Pinryan nila over si Lina. Parehas oh, oh. available. At hanggang natin, kitang-kita nyo gano'ng Kita kadaling oh. counter yung si Lina. Oo. Oh, oh. Sa... Sa Khalid. Sa Khalid, hindi ka pwedeng ano doon, magdasal. Yun na nga eh, hindi ka pwedeng magdasal. Tatamaan ka ng pana. Tatamaan ka ng pana. So the regeneration and outplay In- mechanic nung uh, Khalid. Impact hmm. twice talaga. Sobrang layo na masasabi ko na between the R, the Selena as well as the Khalid. Kung first pick lang ang usapan, min, 100% of the time, Selena talaga. Masyadong mabilis to. Na, I mean, this is too much. Hindi lang sa draft may binibigay yung NXP ngayon. Oo. Oh. Pati na rin ngayon dito sa laro natin, mga tol. Nice mm-hmm. arrow once again from Hayes. Half man, half amazing. Yeah, kumagat na lang. <laughs> And of course, may isang dash pa naman na pwedeng gawin si uh, Hayes dito. Uh, also, um, we can see Heath na dapat talaga... Uh, knowing teams, top teams that are in a winning record ngayon, never nila ibibigay yung show sa, sa Omega nang walang kapalit. Yeah. This yeah. time, NXP Solid had the chance to take away that claw doon sa... Uh, sorry, that show doon sa draft. Yeah, gusto ko lang ibanggitin sa inyo guys. Ah, wait, we have the dragon. Chester. Okay, okay. That, that's good. Um, gusto ko lang sa banggitin na 
again, di naman sa uh, laging autoban dapat yung show against it, no? Pero baka may sinabi mo, dapat may kapalit. Dapat may kapalit, dapat exactly. May kapalit. Oh, kasi, uh, tingnan mo kung ka- No! No, hate. <laughs> hate. Hate, ladies and gentlemen. So underrated. You can actually see, guys, that there is oh. a warranted respect talaga for this guy. Oh. No, oh. Kailangan mong tandaan. Feeling ko, yung NXP solid dito, gagawa na silang note. Don't give Keith. Oh. Don't give choke sa Omega in general. Sana kung may kufra ka lang sana eh, no? Kahit pa paano, di ba? Oh. I mean, I, I, I ma-forgive ma- ko na binigay nila yung Selena kung hindi nila binigay yung choke. But then, both of it, given sa Omega, sabi na Omega, oh, thank you. Yeah. He's a very slidey hero. Ladies and gentlemen, and the thing about uh, Khalid, no, na support, hindi siya tulad pa rin ng Natalia. Actually, mas mababa yung damage siya sa Natalia. Yung know. utility niya lang ang taas, and they're really going all in the Khalid. They were able to punish him. There's gonna be haze. Tinanggal ulit. Oh. May bite, trap, abyssal, arrow. Konti na lang yung boy dito. Oh. And then, second of the third strike, ang daming pinagdahanan ni Chester. Grabe. <laughs> Nagdasal that lahat, kaso... <laughs> Pinauna na pa. Pero kung ano yung binigay talaga sa kanya eh. Yeah. And that's it. That's <laughs> what they are doing. And the problem here is supposedly kahit pa paano, kung kahit support yan, medyo kailangan pa rin ng Khalid magka-impact by mid-game eh, di ba? Oh man. Hindi siya pwede maging pre-kill. Melee hero yan. And this is not a diggy na pwedeng feeding. Strategy! Hey! Oh! Strap of Fu! Abyssal trap. Not gonna be enough. Dito si Toshi. Oh! Yes! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, by the way, far sa side lanes, kaya din naman uh, valid siya sa side lanes. Is pwede siyang pumunta sa mid bigla using the wings by wings. Yeah. Traverse map, traverse ay mataas para dito sa uh, team far sa kaya nagfit siya sa mga conditions kung saan naanapin mo para sa isang uh, valid na side lane. Hindi pwede. Ang hirap niya to. Hindi pwede yung ganito. Cause Right now, kailangan makabawi, makabalik yung confidence ng uh, NXP. Oh, and that is nice. one that is a very good catch by Renegade J on to uh, Toshi. And there's another drop towards Yami na Manchester sa may pinaka-backline. Zoning out Haze, pero alam natin na hindi siya tatatala ng mga membro ng taga Omega. Rather, he will go for the suicide dive and focus on to Haze. Meron pang isang garote pala yun. Chester using his regeneration on. He has to walk no, away. Oh, Nakapag-shoot po pala yun pa. And they turn their eyes pabalik kay Chester. At again, babalik na rin sila Yami at MB. Uh. Haze is just half an hour of Haze. Oh, oh man. This is not the few Selena or the great Selena, pero iba yung take na nakita natin yun. Sobrang na-bait din dito yung ating Gatot Kacha to go in. Fortunately, para sa Eric's B-Solid, paring Shinbu, this is not really the, mo- the, the worst the tra- of trade-offs. I guess yung fact na si Chester pa rin yung namatay doon, it's still okay. Okay, yeah. As long as di nadadali si H2, wala pa rin death si H2. Yes. That is the consen- consistency on that guy. Ang problem lang din is when map is lost, nararamdaman talaga yun ni H2, no? That's right. That's Especially right. Especially when objectives are being denied onto him. At kahit na mga green dots na yan, malaking kawalan din. Oo naman. And now, defense from Yawi dun sa may gitna. Not gonna be enough. That yeah. is... Kapiting lang si Dito, GC, grabe talaga yung follow-up ni Hayes. Nakita mo yan. Done for Rene J. Wala nang no choice si Rene J dito. Went for the regeneration for the minion wave. Pero masyado na mababa yung buhay. And natuluyan. Nang-execute doon ng mga taga-Omega. Oh my goodness. Ang dami din kasi nakikita natin looming issues para sa NXP. And I guess that when we said that during the draft, masyado maraming binigay NXP solid, kitang-kita nyo naman kung baakit malakas ang Omega with these heroes. Not only because of this is Omega. Pati yung mismong nature ng mga heroes na to. Like, looking at Selena, nakikita nyo naman, kahit sino ang humawak nito, sa kahit anong team, if you're looking at the lineup of NXP Solid na malalambot lahat halos mm. in the early stages of the game, yeah. ito natin na talaga nag-flourish. Tapos, itong si Claude, dependent siya sa um, idea na dapat medyo maluwag para sa kanya yung early game. Hindi siya dapat nape-pressure ng ganito. Yeah. I mean, obviously, zero death, zero assist on mm-hmm. H2O. Level 8 nga lang siya. Compare mo kay GZ, Level 11 na. Pero makapasok lang si H2 ng Blazing 2. Actually, two core items, feeling ko matataya pa rin naman ni H2. We need to see kung gano'ng kalahas yeah. yung farm uh, niya. Yung game-changing play lang talaga. There's gonna be a kite. Maggrabe si Hit. Know. Nakita mo yung flicker dun sa may dulo ng wall na pwersa na si H2 na i-burn i- i- ngayon. Yung kanyang purification and Chester ulit, hindi na talaga bibilib si Gaara. Dahil kita mo naman dito si Khalid na wala. We also got that uh, of Calamity Reaper na nakuha naman ni Ren J. Man, wala pang buong item dito si... Uh, H2. H2, apart from the it's machete, very, pero very. Hindi si Hajizi. May ano ba yung machete? Ay, hindi pa, nimble blade pa lang. Nimble blade. 
Walang, oh my Ball God. That's 3K. Yeah, that's a bit. 3.3K. Yeah, 3.3K, hindi pa yan talaga. Kung meron siyang utrinay, buhay minutes. na mag-DHS. And the 8 minutes, this is... Hindi ko maalala kung ito yung, uh, yung pinakamababang performance talaga ni H2. Kasi ang bilis nag-escalate nung larong to ngayon. Oh, eh. no. Hindi pwede. We got here. Chester nakabuo na. He, did, uh, he went for the Queen's Wings. Ladies and gentlemen, and things are looking so intense here for NXP as Omega has taken full control. Andun si Hit. Kahit siya yung in-initiate, siya pa yung manggagalit. Natignan natin ngayon. Full bar here for Chester. Lalayo na lamang sila. At wala na nipis na yung mapa. Ano na to inhibitor turret na na ano? Sobrang Kasi nipis nung mapa dito. Chim, di, wala wala mahanap na opening para sa mga pag-farm dito yung Claude. Unless of course Omega either nag-feed sila sa NXT Solid or kapag nilet go nila na konti yung control. Which is two things na hindi manggagalit from Omega. This is a team na alam kung paano mag-close out ng games. Alam kung paano alam nila. I ipamuka sa kalaban nila kung gano sila kalamang. Uh -huh. And they're gonna do it now. Uh -huh. Malala alam ma alam natin yung mga teams na ano na marunong talaga mag-close out ng games. Actually bilang lang yung teams sa MPL na medyo hirap mag-close out ng games eh when oh. in the lead like for example BSB, di ba? Yes, yes. Pero itong mga ganitong kalibre na teams, ay execution. Pero kahit pa paano, <laughs> iba, iba, iba yung iba, exception to the rule. Lagi exception to the rule. Exception to the rule, execution. <laughs> sa mga di nila alam at oh. alam nilang bagay. Oh. <laughs> it's not about the analytics of the game anymore. Uh, pag, it's, a, uh, it's a show uh, on itself. Uh, <laughs> pure heart. Pure heart. Pure, ano, pure EQ. Yep. <laughs> All right, so, and we don't want execration to change. Uh, 11, oh yeah. Hindi na yun execration. Pag hindi ganun yun ka erratic. Uh, no, right. diba? We have uh, 12k on the gold lead dito. Ng Omega. Paring Wolf. Yep. It's only a matter of time with this kind of itemizations para kay H2. Yeah. Chester. Yeah. I, I don't see a blazing duet will be so hurting. Chester sa may pinakaharapan and um, man, tinalo ni Shikamaru dito. Oo. Oh. Si Gaara. Wala si Shikamaru. Wala ka si Shikamaru eh. But blazing duet. Ladies and gentlemen, now for Yawi, inikutan na rin ni Ren J dito. Activate his ultimate just so they can get the wave clear. And it's a mega kill. Tabs. Saan yep. yun? Tabs yun na nakuha yung patay para kay H2 dito and Ogi shadow kill din nila. Pero of course, babalik pa sa kanyang quad shadow si Hadji. You see the arrow here missing in the on sa ating export. It should be it. They still have plenty of control ngayon dahil lalo oh. na napapun. Tila si H2 War Energy nagsasaktan ngayon. Rage 2 was 0 and 1 and no items to boot. Oh, man. This probably is one of his Sino MVP worst games, if yun? not the worst. Oh. Ano sa'yo? Hit or ano? Haze, no? Oo nga eh. Hindi ko masabi eh. <laughs> Pero grabe yung playmaking ni Hit eh, no? Yeah, I think that ito ibibigay mo kay Hit. Kay Hit yeah, ito. May team yung mga pana to matama pero yung fact na hirap na hirap itong Sila kay Hit ay mga Hit. Yeah, it's a kind of a given here. Rene J, I mean, he cannot even afford to really go, go near. Kahit yung ult niya is up. There's an opinion wave to finish this. And this game 1 will, yes, easily go 